Hey everybody, Beard Brigade here with uh, a new kind of episode. Um, tossing the waters here, seeing what uh, how this goes, and, and uh, seeing what kind of feedback I get out of this video. Uh, as you can see, I am in. I need to change the audio because I just realized how loud that is. Uh, but I don't think the video options are going to fix that. Here we go. So, turn down that stuff. So, uh, we are in Payday 2, which is a first-person shooter heist game. Uh, so you play through heists. Um, if you ever saw the movie Heat, this is the game for you if you ever wanted to play Heat. So, uh, basically you just go through and you do different missions and your objective is to basically rob this place or form a heist, essentially. Uh, anything from robbing an armored car to uh, stealing from a bank to um, robbing a museum, uh, turning over a jewelry store, all kinds of crazy things. So, uh, kind of doing this similar to the Skyrim challenge. Um, it's just kind of a base, get everyone's take on it. So, I uh, came up with some criteria, uh, which basically was uh, determining like a one through this, and then had someone actually it was my wife, uh, give me a number between that and that determined my criteria. So uh, we will actually pop over our inventory so I can show you what I'm going to be having to do. So uh, she had to pick a number based um, on the types of gun varieties you had for your primary and your secondary slot. Uh, for my primary slot, she ended up picking the uh, Kingbo or dual wielding submachine guns which the current uh, submachine guns I had were the Akimbo Swedish K submachine guns, which I have loaded out for um, all hell breaking loose. Uh, and then for my secondary weapon, again, she ended up picking the submachine gun. All right, I decided to get a new gun. I got the CR-805B submachine gun, which I set up for silent mode. Uh, the next number she picked uh, hooked me up with the 350K brass knuckles. Uh, I'm going ahead and going with my standard throwing weapon, which is my incendiary grenade. Uh, she then picked uh, that I have to wear the biggest tactical armor in the game, all while performing a heist mission as sneaky as possible. So I am equipped to basically just blow the crap out of everything and go to war, but I have to attempt to do this mission in stealth. So, um, I'm not going to go for, since this is a, a trial run, I'm not going to be going with a, uh, requires stealth mission, just because this is a trial run for this video. So, um, what we will be doing is I'm going to go ahead and go to the contract broker, and you know what, I think the best bet for this is going to be... We're going to do a bank heist random, and it looks like I have to do it on the overkill difficulty. Uh, it's, it's the middle of the road difficulty, but it can still be a pain in the butt difficulty if you're not prepared. So alright, uh, basically the way this, uh, this particular bank heist works is that it works like the normal everyday bank heist mission that comes with the game. But rather than knowing what is in the bank vault, it could be anything from cash to gold to just the straight up whatever is in the deposit boxes. Um, typically the goal is to get in and out with at least three to four bags of loot, depending on the difficulty. Uh, the higher the difficulty, the more bags you need. So let us just dive right in and try to go about this as sneaky as possible, wearing and being equipped with almost the, <laughs> with the near almost impossible sneaky equipment um, for it. So hopefully this doesn't go horribly wrong. Uh, now I'm playing live, so I'm not going to be doing. I'm not going to be um, uh, playing solo. Uh, we do have the option to play solo on Payday 2. I'm going to play with other people, but. Uh, I figured it helped me out with this, and we'll, we'll run around with other people for the video. So, uh, let us see here. Keep waiting. Don't 
don't mind if I have the bulk key. That's fine by me. Okay. If there's one thing you don't want to find yourself in shortage of, it's medical supplies. Ammunition. Can you ever have too much of it? Earth. And now. Okay, this is the bag. Okay, people, there's the bag. I don't know what's in there, but I know it's gonna be good. I'll give you this as sneaky as possible here. Thank you, Akiri Stiff. Oh, even the hands. He's in an attempt to not get in the way. Um, Think here. Um, yeah. All right, let's just run in and crowd control. Teamwork makes the dream work. I will climb the guard. Bag and tag. Get through this here.
Alright, where is this last guard? Okay. off. Let's hope we can. Alright. Pound it off, so oh well. Okay, great. I've got that thing to the vault door. Nice. Now start her up. Here we go. We should be through in a couple of minutes. The police are here! Stand them down! Alrighty. More cops on the way! Drill it us. Oh, yeah, packages. So, one of the cool things about Payday is uh, the packages, when you collect enough of them, give you um, mods for your weapons. And again, I think my audio is kind of up there again. Do I can just calm it down a little bit more? Going here, so. <laughs> oh, it hurts the face. Alright, good lord. Oof, I'm taking a beating in this one. Oh. Thanks to my significant other for putting me into this torturous event. <laughs> Honestly, though, it was, it's not too bad. I mean, I mean, it could have been a lot worse. I could have ended up with like a rocket launcher and trying to do stealth. Uh, at least I had a weapon that I could I could get I could get one and, and attempt to do it kind of sneaky. Oh, 
I just totally realized that I have. Planks, so I could totally have been barricading windows right now. I am a dum dum. myself into. Ugh, still one more minute. I saw an article, I think it was a video, I didn't actually watch it, but I saw the headline for it, and I kind of almost want to go back and try and find it now, but, uh, to see if it was actually legitimately about that or not, but it was about um, <laughs> the gamer's problem of chronically, of chronic reloading. And now that I think about it, just at least with this... Like, as I've been going through this playthrough, I have pretty frequently hit that reload button. sucks. Oh. 
hope my team gets through it. Come on, guys. Come on, team. Let's go, team. Let's go. Let's go, team. Let's go. <laughs> well, we got through it. One faithful trophy. Huh. Well, at least in the end, it was still it was you know, paying for itself. So that wasn't that wasn't too bad for a video. I think. Um, I don't know how I want to do it for challenges going forward, or if that was, that was the best you did. Anyway, uh, let me go what you guys thought of that in the comments below. I'm gonna, I mean, that's gonna be, it's gonna be all she wrote for this video. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. So of course, if you, if you did enjoy the video, hit that like button below. If you're looking forward to uh, videos, or uh, please, uh, you know, I'm really looking forward to watching my videos or. Or, uh, you know, come back, check out. I'm probably going to have some more one off episodes before I go back to doing a, a, a Skyrim challenge. Uh, so hit that subscribe button for me. That way you can come back as soon as I have my next video and it'll let you know when that video is up. You can check it out. Because um, I'm looking for feedback, guys. Uh, and, and gals, I, I want to know what you think of my video so far, what videos you have and haven't liked. Uh, let me know because I want to, uh, you know, really focus on the ones that are enjoyable and have been fun for everyone, um, or if just being random and, and and all over the board is is just as good. Let me know. Uh, I am more than happy to do uh, a bunch of in between videos all the time. So uh, with that, thank you guys so much for watching. Uh, like I said, like and subscribe uh, if you've enjoyed yourself. But we have reached the point of the show, which is probably, I don't know, for a reason, it's quickly becoming my favorite part of the show, and that is updating our playlists on Spotify. So, we four are an eclectic playlist. Let's see. Like, what's a good heist song? Good heist music. What would be good heist music? Let's think. Um, I'm thinking something. I'm thinking something dubstep. Uh, you know what? I I know. I gotta find the song because I don't remember what the name of the song is. Um, doo -doo -doo. Name of the song. Name of the song. Where is it? Trying to find it among the artist's songs. It's like the one, <laughs> the one song that's on this. Uh, let's see. Oh, that was the album. That was it. I have this album sitting in the other room. I should just probably, at this point, I feel like I should just grab that and do it that way. And it's the end. What is it? See more releases.
But why can't I find this one France one? Oh. Because it looks like they don't actually have this one on me. Really? Wow. We're just gonna have to pick a different song then. Oh, that, that kind of sucks. Um, this is the first time I've actually come across a song on Spotify. Or the song that I want hasn't been on. Hasn't been on it. And that kind of. kind of makes me sad because. I really like that song. And. I kind of want to listen to it now, and I don't think I'm going to be able to, and that just makes me sad panda. No, it has to be on this one. Yes, there it is. Ha! Huh. Well, the name of the song is Ragabomb by Skrillex. I probably pronounced that horribly, but that is our song for the Nerd Collective playlist. Finally came across it on Spotify. That took forever. Um, because I completely forgot. <laughs> to be honest, I actually forgot the name of the song, and I was hoping just by looking at it that I would recognize it. Uh, it took me actually recognizing the album art to, to figure it out. Uh, sorry, that took so freaking long. But that is going to be our Nerd Collective song. Now we have to do our song of the day. Song of the day. Yeah, yeah. Song of the day. Yeah, yeah. Uh, uh, uh. Yeah, yeah. I, pff, ignore me. That was... That's pretty goofy. Um, so... Oh, 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 oh. We are gonna go... and revisit our friends of Psycho Stick. Uh, who brought us... Obey the Beard. The next song that we will be adding um, to uh, the song of the day is uh, Psycho Stick's Numbers I Can Only Count to Four. The best way to describe this song, uh, if you know who Drowning Pool is, or if you're familiar with the song Let the Bodies Hit the Floor, uh, which is our how that song goes, and then the natural song is called Bodies. If you are familiar with this song, you will instantly recognize this song. You will recognize this as if basically Weird Al did a cover of that song, and did his, his thing. It's basically what that song is, but it's Psycho Stick's version, and it is hilarious. This song Get Up, and I think it's actually really fitting for, the, for, for this video. Uh, so, as always guys, thank you so much. Like and subscribe. Uh, if you haven't hit those buttons already for me, uh, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. Please leave me comments below. Tell me what you thought of, of this particular challenge. Uh, whether you liked it, you disliked it. Uh, if, if you're on the fence, you know, let me think, let me know, uh, if this is a video that you guys would be interested in seeing me go forward with, uh, or even potentially going forward with, uh, Payday 2 is a game that I really enjoy. Um, you know, I like playing it, um, so you know, giving me that extra reason to, to definitely log on and, and, and share some of my goofiness with this game with you guys. Um, but either way, just let me know. Um, if you're kind of on the fence about it or you didn't like it, please leave me uh, additional feedback. Let me know uh, other things that, that you think I should do. Uh, you, know, I, you know, whether it be... Uh, maybe each video I, I, I ask you guys what, what you want me to do next, what, what setup do you want me to use, what guns do you want me to use, do I have to be sneaky, do I have to be loud, or, or if you think, you think I should just come up with a, a roll table like I did with Skyrim and post that up on the website, more than happy to do any of that kind of stuff. Um, so thank you again so much for watching, leave me those comments, and you guys take care and have a fantastic rest of your day.